Hey everybody, I guess Spirit said we'll figure out a way to get me on this camera today. Um, I knew that this, I, I don't know why it keeps shutting off near the end of my videos. But I'll go back to the colors because that's pretty much where, um, and I'm looking down so I apologize for that. Let me get out of that glare. Um for the rainbow jack dragon which color are you attracted to in the card and if it was the pink and purple that's the earth and it is grounding nature practical life cycles balance and harmony if you are focusing on the white that is air and that's your breath and meditation and clarity of consciousness if you focused on the blue like me that's what i focused on when i got this card it was um water and um, what you were, um, what that was, is accessing and freeing emotions, truth, and expression. <sighs> See that glare. And then um, if you are focusing on the red and orange, that was fire. And that's finding your passion. And if you focused on the purple, I focused on that one too, but the blue was more of my color, was spirit spirit and um if you did that you're placing you on your life direction harmonizing the yin and yang energies emergence of one with spiritual law which is identifying patterns and rules governing life creation awareness and higher frequency this was a great reading um somebody needs to get out of um turn that starry starry dreams turn it back around let me see because i have the cards right behind me um i can kind of show you they're like right there you see all my other cards sorry about that but yeah they're the good cards right there so um you need to get out of that this is a. Uh, it looks like it's a romantic um reading i try not to focus on um divine uh the love aspect of the twin flame journey, not because I don't want to focus on it, but there's so many other people focusing on that. And also I feel that, um, you need to get into union with you. If you don't understand who you are first, it won't matter with divine masculine because you're going to still, you're going to repeat a cycle. You have to, you have to get out of that. You got to get out of that push and pull where it's just, you just got to have them. Now, and, and I know that push and pull is, is, is crazy. I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. And for me, I deleted Facebook off of my phone. I don't have it on my tablet. I don't even remember the last time that I went on Facebook. I do have Messenger. So if somebody, you know, that, because my family is on there, you know, stuff like that, um, out, of, out of state family. So if they really need to contact me and they don't have my my personal home number, they can contact me on Facebook. I'll respond to that, but I'm not going on Facebook. There's too many lessons on there. Actually, I call it Sodom and Gemeyer. That's what I call Facebook. That's a, that's a, that's a hell. That's a Hades. It's a, it's full of a karmic lessons full of them and so i don't deal with that anymore that's that's another aspect that i don't have to focus on you know when you release things that don't mean you any good any way shape and form facebook that's for me that's facebook it don't mean me no good you know all it would do is just aggravate me and so that's who needs that life is supposed to be where you're happy you why you always got to be worried about what somebody else is doing if it's constantly coming up in your face so, and my counterpart is beginning to understand that. It's really interesting because while I was over there, <laughs> you know, I was sit, sitting on my phone doing my thing and he was on, you know, he was on Facebook. He literally was. And, you know, I knew he was on Facebook, but I didn't care because I ain't on Facebook. You know, whatever lessons he's learning over there, that's what he's learning. And it's funny because he'll show me stuff on Facebook. Look at this, such and such and such. And I'll look at it. Okay, and then I turn my head and keep on moving. Facebook it means me no good. Unless it's a good friend or somebody that's really hurt, 
you know, are going through some things. And nine times out of ten, I have their phone number. Um, and that's the other thing I did. I changed my phone number. So the people on Facebook, if you're not family, they're not family. They don't have my phone number, so they can't even contact me that way. I made sure that I, I snipped all of that. You know, I didn't want to be bothered with that. Um, I didn't want to be hindered in my journey with my divine masculine, which we already been in. We've already been in union for a while. I didn't know it, but we've already been in. We've already been in union. I'm doing things backwards. I guess my journey is I'm hard headed. I guess spirit said, okay, we're going to let her do her thing her way. Now I am getting in alignment with myself. So when I do these readings and I read for myself, I'm doing it for me to get in union with me. I, you know, and I, I pretty much, I have an understanding of who I am. I think just with some of the karmic lessons that I had experienced, um, I think I forgot some of the, you know, forgot who I was. I know I'm a child of the king, you know, royalty, spirit, purple. I like purple, but I know blue is what I need. Blue is my voice. I know I'm supposed to be doing this. Um, I don't know why that looks crazy. Um, um, but anyway, um, I'm hoping that you all enjoy the reading. Um, I think I'm going to continue to do it this way. Um, I think I'm going to get a table because that's a sofa back there. If you didn't notice there's, um, there's a sofa. I can sit back on the sofa and if I can get like a stand or something, and then I can pull the cards that I need that way. And I can fix the stand where it faces me. I think, I think I'm going to work it out one way or the other. Um, but um, thank you for stopping by Healing Conversations with Z. Um, come back again. Um, yeah. We'll see about this. Me being on camera. Sometimes I would be on camera. Sometimes when I would do my readings, I would have my pajamas on or, or rollers in my head. So that's a lot of times where I wouldn't be on camera. But I'm not looking like that today. So it is what it is. But thanks for stopping by. Come back again. Please make comments. Um, if you want to like and subscribe, I'd appreciate that too. Again, no later than Saturday. I want it to be no later than Friday. I'm going to figure out how to put in where I can do um, readings, where you can contact me for readings. I don't know if I'm going to use Zoom. I have Zoom. Um, I may do that because then we can do a face-to-face. Um, but, um, I can do, um, I guess I could just do the, like I'm doing a reading here, like I'm doing this. I could send it to you privately that way. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. Um, I've been asking my soul family lots of questions. You know, I want to make sure I ain't getting in trouble with the government and all this other kind of stuff, you know, cause you got to pay Caesar his money. And I want to make sure I do that as well. You know, this, I, I, when I come to you, I'm coming to to, to you in full integrity. Um, I have nothing that I want to take from you. I don't want to use you. I want to give. If anything, I'm giving to you. Um, and actually for me, I do a lot of my work in the 3D. So I'm getting blessed in other realms. This is just one realm of my life. Um, there are many realms that I deal with. Um, the 3D realm outside, I'm getting I'm getting blessed constantly. Um, it might not be financially, but I, I never really focused on the financial. For me, money was a tool. Um, I understand we need it. Um, it is what it is, but I don't focus on it. Um, I focus on being blessed in other ways, but... On this journey, I am learning that I do have to get my pentacles up. Not that I don't have none, but is you, you know, as I bless others, they will bless me in return. And I think by me starting this channel in this way, this will be a way for me to um, work on that aspect of my journey um, in this community. So... 
um, thank you all again for stopping by. Um, please continue to stop by. Send other people by so they can be blessed as well. Um, I appreciate you all listening to me. And I like I like the comments that people have given me. A lot of times I can't comment. You know, I may be in an area where I can't really do a lot, but um, I do appreciate your comments. I do appreciate when your likes. So keep it coming. Um, and as always, you be peaceful. I'll see you soon. Thank you.